guys, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I made these pottery inspired little vases. This is a Dollar Tree little project, so it's not that expensive. Most of the things I had on hand, so this only cost me $2. From Dollar Tree, I purchased this lightweight spackling and also this little vase right here. Each item was $1, so this is why I only spent $2. This spackling was sliding around, I guess because this is glass, but I decided to keep on going. And what I did is I coated two different glasses and I let them sit and dry. This spackling does not dry hard is what I learned and it does crumble. But if you're going to be using this as decoration, it doesn't really matter because nobody's going to be touching them. So this is why I decided to keep on with this video anyways because the finished product is super cute. This was also filmed over a week ago and they've been sitting on my counter and they have given me no problems. So what I did is I coated both of them twice and I waited for them to completely dry before adding the second coat. Like I said, this does not dry hard so it's kind of soft. And I just went in there with a sanding paper and as you can see a little piece fell out but that's okay because that could just be the back of it so I lightly sanded the whole thing not going too crazy because if you go a little hard it will fall apart I do think the spray paint helped keep it all together so I do recommend spray painting it but like I said you don't have to you can just leave it like that nobody's gonna touch them anyways after I sanded them Jonathan went ahead and spray painted them for me and we just used this black spray paint after they fully dried, I went ahead and I used this twine that I already had at home. I'm pretty sure you could find this at the Dollar Tree as well. And I just wrapped it around and added a bow. Once my two little vases were complete, I just added some greenery, some flowers, and that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!